No longer do you have to have your music either stop or start. You can now add fades to your music in Instagram Reels, which is awesome because this is also going to allow you to add multiple songs together. And I'm going to show you how in this video. I'm going to start by just creating a reel and I'm going to add a couple uh, clips into it. So one second as I find just a video. I've been really busy and I haven't cleaned up my roll yet. I love these shots, just ocean. So I have this shot. So I want the music to come in and then go out. So what I do is I'm just gonna turn down the volume because I can't share music on here. If I share my YouTube video, I'm gonna have a copyright problem. So I'm not gonna do it too loud. I'm just gonna add a clip. There you go. Here's a nice song that I can add to it. And now what I can do is I can change the beginning and the end. So the beginning, eases into the music and then it eases, fades out. So it's this new fade button here at the bottom. To access it, you gotta make sure that the audio clip is turned, clicked on. So it's the, you just have the yellow around the audio clip, that means it's on. And then press this fade button. What this is going to allow you to do is allow you to start the music up to 12 seconds. That's a pretty long time. So you can see as I'm moving the fade button, it's quieting the music at the beginning and then it's making it start later. Go longer, you can see that like the curve of the music is like super quiet. And then it just gets louder for the end. And then you can just go in and you can adjust it too. So I can have it as a smaller curve. You can see here in three seconds, it just makes it a flatter thing. And if you listen to it, it's just gonna have quieter, and then the music's gonna come up. And then you can do the same thing for the end. So we can fade out. So it's like a smooth end to the music. This also works if you wanna add multiple songs and if you wanna mix from one to another. So I'm just gonna shorten this audio clip. I'm gonna shorten it so it's like halfway. And then say I wanna add another audio clip and it's gonna go from the one to the other. I'm just gonna add another audio clip there we go. That's the one I want to add. I can add that fade to that one as well. So fade in. Let's get, let's get a fade out as well. And then let's extend that clip so it goes to the end. And then the trick here is just to have them so that as the one goes down, the other one goes up. So this might be too long of a fade to do that. So let's have the fade in a little bit shorter of a fade. Perfect, scroll down, and then let's match those together. And you can see as one music comes out, the other one's gonna come in. I'm sorry you can't really hear because copyright infringements, but trust me, it works, try it out. This is really cool because now you're able to change have the music stop whenever you want before you weren't able to do this and this just really allows for you to have really control about where the music is going to appear in your reels and then i want to show you one more thing so in case you want the music to have multiple music tracks but you also want to have the music from the video because this is waves it's the ocean of course i want some waves in there so to adjust that you're going to go to your volume and this is where you can control the volume of all the outputs of the music. So I can get um, the video up and then I can take down the music. And then you can hear there's water, there's one song, there's another song, and it just allows all the music to come on together and say I want to get rid of that clip and it's gonna take it down and I can take it up and down. If you have a real question, please leave it in the comments because I use the comments to come up with my video ideas for upcoming YouTube videos. Until next time, peace.